Hello and welcome to another EVE Online video. Today I'm going to show you how to set up the Corporation Moon Mining Tax. So as you are going along moon mining, um, a lot of times you'll run into um, the station wants you to pay them a tax. And that's how it is for all of, all of our stations and all the stations in our lines. So if you have um, you access to their chat they'll tell you okay 5% to this person or 10% to this person so what does that mean so we're gonna go over what it is why it's necessary and then how to pay for it right so what they're asking for is a percentage of the ore that you've mined which goes back to the station owner in order to help pay for the continued upkeep of the station so that owner can take that ore uh, sell it or convert it to minerals or do whatever they want with it in order to recoup the costs of operating uh, an Athenor. So let's say, for example, this is your character. Obviously, this isn't a mining ship, but we use it for an example. One of the first things you need to make sure is that all, all of the, the ore that you've mined is in your item hanger, right? So put it all in there, and then we're going to calculate it out. So for simplicity's sake, we're going to say that the station owner wants 10%. Okay. So we're going to separate our stacks here into uh, 10%. Okay. So I'm going to hold shift, click over. Okay. 57.47 was what we had. So I'm going to go 57.5. 575. So it's safe to just round up. That way you're not shorting them on a little bit, but it doesn't really matter one way or the other. So this one's 13,782. So we'll go 13,079. So 1,379. Boom. So these two are your tax that's 10 percent of of all of the ore that you got so what we're going to do next we're going to highlight both of them right click as long as this is in your item hanger you'll have the option for create contract okay so go ahead and hit that your create contract is going to pop up what type is it going to be it's going to be an item exchange and if they give you a name it's going to be private okay so we're just going to say Okay, Art and Teag, for example, is who we're going to send the ore to. Okay, that's it. Item exchange, private, and we're going to hit next. Now, this is just a screen that's going to show you. This is the station that you're located in, that your items are located in. These are the two items that you're going to put up on the contract. Now, it shows you everything that's in your item hanger, but it only it's going to check only the ones that you had highlighted at the beginning so we're going to hit next I will, I will pay you can leave that at zero you're not going to pay them any isk and you're not going to receive any isk so both of these will be set to zero you're just giving over the ore there's no isk involved All right it is nice to set your expiration to four weeks so they have the most amount of time in order to collect that contract it makes no difference to you um, which one you select here but it's nice for the owner to have the most amount of time possible for description you can put something like or tax 10 percent or or whatever into the description honestly if you just leave it blank I'm sure they'll understand what it is okay we're gonna hit next now this is your confirm screen you're gonna go over everything no isk involved there is a 10k isk broker's fee but that's just standard across the board everything looks good you're gonna hit finish really create contract yes boom there you go now you've set up your contract you're you've paid off your your ore and you are good to leave with all of the moon ore that you've mined thank you